outline of your PowerPoint presentation. Remember you have given 15 to 20 minutes to present your slides and keep in mind using the previous tips and advices to use or present your slides in a God format using Microsoft Office PowerPoint and Data Show. We will start with the, the title using the information provided in your cover page, theme, supervising jury members, academic year, etc. And then the outline, present your outline in slide two. the outline, the overview, and then introduction about your topic or your thesis using general introductions as well as the rationale why you choose this topic, and then research background. Every previous studies that you put or offer in this on your thesis. And then we have statement of the problem. Mention your gap, your questions, your hypotheses, and state your problem briefly and clearly. Number six, aim objectives and the scope of the study mention them as a bulleted or as notes state your aim and state your objectives and what is the scope of your study number seven literature review use your theories about your variables How many variables you have each variable you should provide theories about it theories and conceptions number eight the most important methodology research set your research approach research design research purpose data source is it primary or not data collection instrument sampling techniques target populations sample size and statistical techniques used in your thesis or your topic or your study slide number nine results and discussions as well as key findings Show your results in the diagrams, schematic diagrams, or charts, tables, etc. and entitle them. You should leave discussions for the presentations for later questions and answers sessions. And then we have conclusions, which you will provide limitations, implications, and your recommendations about your study work then you should mention your references as a proof maybe and finally we have two optional pages which uh, are Acknowledgements and thank you page. They are optional. 